Hey guys, welcome back. This has been off from the BTN HD. And yes, uh, quick tip. Uh, I was playing around with my virtual infrastructure, the one that I use for the server room uh, every Saturday at 3 o'clock Eastern Standard Time. And um, apparently ESXi doesn't have a bridge mode, which I like using bridge mode to have one IP address. That IP address has internet access and then it kind of like provides internet access to all my virtual machines without retrieving another IP address within my DHCP server. Okay, so I did a little research and it looks like PFSense does that. It's a open source router slash firewall utility that works extremely well. Now the way that you get it set up within the ESXi or the ESX is doing this. You wanna get inside your configuration you go to networking and within networking you go to add networking and you do a virtual machine click next when you get to this portion right here you want to do a creative vSphere standard switch uh, give it a name uh, erase this and hit enter so do not assign an adapter to it so the way I did it was I created a vSwitch 2 I called it NAT network with no physical adapter now, this guy right here, you could download it on the site as a USB, uh, I believe a nano uh, virtual machine for Hyper-V and an ISO. I downloaded the ISO and I'm gonna right click on it because I wanna show you the settings that I did within the ESXi client. So the settings that I did was I gave it two virtual NICs. This is the V switch that has internet access. This is the one that's going to grab an IP address or within the PFSense virtual machine, you could assign an IP address. And then another adapter, which is assigned to your NAT network, okay? You launch the PFSense, follow the instructions, very self-explanatory, very easy. It automatically configures itself, so you don't need to do much. I am going to open up the console to show you guys what happens. So again, one adapter is automatically attached to the network, which is grabbing an IP address from my DHCP server. And then what happens that it sees the second NIC card and says to itself, okay, that's the WAM. And then the second NIC card is your LAN, right? So these, this is the IP address pool that you're gonna be giving out your computers, your clients. Again, you are able to configure and assign interfaces. Assign an IP address to your WAM is up to you, but I left everything as the default to make life easy for me. Now I have a virtual machine right here. So if I click on VM and go to edit settings and within the network adapter, I'm assigned to internal, but internal does not have any type of access. So if I do a CMD and I do a ping to Google, and I do a dash T. Again, cannot be resolved because there's nothing. Now if I go into VM and I go to edit settings and I go inside my network adapter and I change it to my NAT network. I'm gonna click OK. So from here I'm going to just let's log off real quick. Let's log off. Do a restart. I'm gonna restart the machine because remember we did a huge configuration setting within the virtual machine. So it's nice that we just restart the virtual machine to see if the settings kick in. Okay, so our virtual machine has restarted. This is a good sign right here. Good. We have no exclamation point. So if I do a VM guess and send a control alt delete, I'm gonna log into the machine, get into the desktop. Awesome. I'm going to right click on the start menu, go to command prompt, and let's do a ping of google.com. Hit enter. And now we are able to talk outside. How awesome is that? Good. A little hiccups, but it's okay. Uh, let's do an IP config and see what IP address we get. And it is providing a 192.168.1. 101, which is actually getting an IP address within a PFSense virtual machine. How cool is that? So this is how you create a kind of a bridge slash NAT kind of configuration within your ESXi. 
Uh, I'm going to place all the links at the bottom so you guys can grab a copy of the PF Scent. Again, it's free. It's awesome. It's super easy to set up. And hopefully you guys enjoy and I catch you guys on the next one. Peace out.